What do childbirth, gastric upheaval, tax audits, and Ishtar have in common? Simple. They're all much more engaging and pleasurable than Operation Body Count, Capstone's new attempt to squeeze some extra money out of the outdated Wolfenstein 3D engine. A truly painful knockoff, Body Count is insulting to anyone who's seen a computer game in the last three years. In Body Count, your mission is to wipe out the terrorist force that has seized the United Nations building. You'll be facing ugly terrorists in ugly surroundings, which makes for an ugly experience. The graphics are just plain bad. But continuity is in Capstone's favor, since the sounds are ridiculous too. This, for example, is the sound of your shotgun being fired. See what I mean? Persistent badness. What's a slime monster doing in a terrorist-controlled government office building? Who cares? Not Capstone, that's for sure. Body Count blatantly disregards its own plot, a good indication of how much time and effort was put into the game. This could be forgiven if the game was in any way fun, but if you've ever played a Wolfenstein 3D type game, you'll quickly see that Body Count has no redeeming qualities whatsoever. Body Count is the Plan 9 from outer space of Wolfenstein clones, except that it has no comedic value. The graphics are bad, the sounds are among the worst I've ever heard, and the gameplay... Well, you could be reorganizing your sock drawer instead. Body Count is a loser of embarrassing proportions, a pathetic rehash that makes Corridor 7 look like Quake in comparison.